What's going on, you guys? Uh, so today we're talking a little bit about Update 14 for Hell Let Loose. Some of the good things, some of the not so good things, and some of the what were they thinking things. Ultimately, I think overall this has been a really good update. The maps are beautiful, um, but we do have to talk about a couple things. We're going to get the negative stuff kind of out of the way first. Um, number one, the sights for the British guns, they're all pretty much wrong and right here you can see the Bren is pretty much useless uh, when you strafe left to right this is just me strafing left to right it completely blocks the view of the main site um, this happens to a lesser degree on the Lee Enfield um, the Sten gun probably the Sten gun it sounds wonderful I'll tell you that right off the bat but it's got gigantic looking sights on it, which is interesting because it's the smallest of all the new guns. Um, for some reason, it appears that you're pressing the gun directly up into your eyeball. Um, they're going to just need to take a look at how they've configured sights for these new weapons. Um, there's a lot of sway on all of them, um, more so than there are in any other gun in the game. So I think this was maybe a design that they intended to put in, but did not intend for it to be as heavy as it is. I'm not really sure how it wasn't caught, but this seems like an easy fix. So one of the more hotly debated topics with this update has been running speed being increased 15% and crouch speed being increased 5%. I think a bigger issue right now is that I think potentially unintentionally that strafe speed was also increased here. And as you can see in those two clips, um, it, makes things look very bizarre. It's incredibly difficult to track a strafing target. It looks like a fly on your screen. Um, this, There's a chance this could be tied into more server load and ping issues as well. But if this is a movement mechanic problem, um, while I think the running speed is actually great, um, they're going to need to address the strafing part of it because this that looks all kinds of wrong, I think, uh, pretty obviously. As I mentioned in the intro, both uh, Al Alamine and Drill both look outstanding, and I'm not sure if they maybe updated the way they shade maps or if they have better texture um, uploads now, but the maps look uh, just all both a little bit more detailed, a little bit better than any of the other vanilla maps or previous maps to this point. With that said, character models um, on the new maps do seem to be a little bit more difficult to see, which that was already difficult in this game to begin with, but I think that's a smaller problem, honestly. And, and overall, again, these, these maps just look outstanding. I think number one, that strafing issue is probably the biggest thing they have to fix, aside from the sights, which again, the sights, easy fix, I think, really. Um, the movement thing is gonna be a little more difficult because they have to change something that I, I think they already made a big decision on um, and or just completely change the strafe speed individually from the rest of the movement mechanics. But I'm going to leave you with this because uh, sometimes Hell Let Loose is one of the funniest games in the world. And that's something that no matter what you feel of updates that come out of this game, this is always a consistent. Appreciate you guys stopping by. Hope you have a great week. Hi, hi, attention, attention. This is Captain Speed. I'm so fucking wasted right now. Hi, Bobo. I I'm your captain. What's this green shit? I'm just gonna talk in the green channel. How are you doing? Hi, Bobo. Hi, Bobo. Bobo, you got a mic, Bobo? You got a microphone, Bobo. I'm talking to you. You're captain. <laughs> your captain's talking to you here. What? Thank you.